Hey everyone, today I'm going to continue the series of showing keyboard shortcuts in Office 365. Today I'm going to show you some of the top keyboard shortcuts in Outlook on the web. So for starters, we're here in our inbox here, and say I've just signed in and I want to search for a specific email. All I have to hit is Alt and then the Q key. And you can see that the cursor here is blinking, ready for me to search. I'll hit Escape to leave that. The escape button is actually really helpful in your inbox as you need to exit a certain message or exit a search. Uh, for instance, if I was tabbing through my emails, all I would have to do to close this would be escape. Now control Q and control U are very helpful as well as you're skimming through your most recent emails. Control Q will mark the selected conversation as read and then control U will mark the selected conversation as unread. So if I'm skimming through my emails by hitting the down button, but I want to go back and make sure I mark this one as unread because I need to go back and reference something from the message, I'll just hit control U. And there it's marked again as unread. Now let's say I wanted to respond to this message here. To just hit a quick response, you can hit control shift R. This will open up a response within the same window and your cursor is ready there for you to begin typing. Now if I wanted to forward this message, I would do a very similar function, which would be Control shift f And here I'm ready to forward on the email. Hope this quick review of keyboard shortcuts and Outlook on the web were helpful. Be sure to download the shortcuts pack to read all the other keyboard shortcuts that'll help you save time. Thanks for joining us today, and we'll see you next time.